Warning, this video and channel may not be suitable for children. Viewer discretion is advised. With that being said, hope you enjoy. You have been warned. Hello everyone, this is the official K-On Gaming HD, and welcome back to Mafia 2 Definitive Edition. Now before I get back into the story, I want to mute the music here real quick, just for now, because I want to take a look here at the extras, because I unlocked some artwork in the um, last video. Alright, car cyclopedia, I'm not going to look at that, that's uh, with all the cars and stuff, don't want to look at that right now, collectibles, alright, these are the playmate, the playmate collectibles that I uh, have unlocked so far, I only have one, two, three, four, five, 5 out of 50. Youch. That's not good. Uh, wanted posters. Holy crap. How many are there? Oh my god. Holy crap. 189 wanted posters? And I haven't got a single one. Wow. Wow. 189 wanted posters, and I haven't got a single wanted poster yet. Alright, here we go. Artworks. Alright, it's painting number one, chapter three, Enemy of the State. Alright. Ooh. Chapter five, The Buzzsaw. Alright. And painting number three, chapter seven, In Loving Memory of Francisco Potenza. All right. Posters. Ooh, I like that. Chapter 2, Home Sweet Home. I like that poster. Reminds me of a old school movie poster. If Mafia 2 was a movie. That's what I could see the po uh the poster actually looking like if Mafia 2 was an actual movie. Ooh, all right. From, again, from Chapter Two, Home Sweet Home. All right. Ooh, Chapter Four, Murphy's Law. Chapter Six, Time Well Spent. All right. Whoa, hello. Chapter Eight, The Wild Ones, from my uh, last video. All right. And I got some pinups. Hopefully I'll be able to show these. Hello. Chapter 2, Home Sweet Home. Chapter 3, Enemy of the State. Whoa! Hello! Chapter 4, Murphy's Law. The only time I'll say that uh, I like whitey tidies. All right, chapter five, the buzzsaw. All right. Ah, <laughs> she's in jail. Oh well. Chapter six, time well spent. That was fun. Hello. Hello, in loving memory of Francisco Potenza. Hello. All right, chapter eight, the wild ones. And that's it. Out of 14. Alright. Well, not a single wanted poster. And I only got 5 out of 50 of the Playmate, aka Playboy, uh, things. Youch. Alright. Actually, I'll put this at... Uh... 
Empire Bait. Empire Bait. I'll leave that at a hundred. Okay, I turned it down a little bit because I noticed my last video, some parts of the game were overlapping my voice. Here we go. Chapter 9. Balls and Beans. Uptown, May 6, 1951. I answer the phone. Door. Alright, alright, alright. Hello? Hello? Yeah, Vito, we got a situation here. Grab a gun and meet me at the bar. And make uh -oh. sure you're driving a decent set of wheels. Okay. Alright, I'll be right there. That doesn't sound good. my Sunday. Thing in here before I go. I could use a drink. Take that. And I could have used a sandwich too. Sandwich. Alright. Magazine, nothing like that in here for me to collect. Nope. Alright. Uh, nope. Alright, on my way. We just want to ask you some questions. Uh oh. If you don't open the door, we're going to open it up for you. That doesn't sound good. Hello. This is the police. This is your last warning. Open the goddamn door. Uh oh. Open up, police. All right. Somebody's having trouble with the police in there. That ain't good. should probably head to a gun shop. I mean, I'm gonna have to turn around. I'm gonna head to a gun shop real quick. Let 
turn the radio up. Okay. Because the music uh, muted in the recording anyway. I mean, it doesn't really matter all that much. The music's, you know, pretty much blocked from being in the recording unless it picks up on my microphone. Why did I honk the horn? I don't freaking know. Hello. Come on in and take a look around. Are you looking to buy a gun or you just need right. some ammo? 38 revolver ammo. 1911. A Magnum. Shotgun. $400. Holy crap. Uh... I'll take some, uh, well, ammo's full. Like <laughs> ammo for that. Gun ain't much without some ammo. All right. All right. Well, hey there, Al. Hey there yourself, Charlie. What brings you to the service station today? All I'm right. Thank you, good sir. Your money is office. always welcome here. We're open Thank you. See ya. Have a great day. Why do fall why do fools fall in love? Ah, this is a classic song. gave my um well, I can't run that red light I already gave my two cents about Frankie Lyman I'm not gonna go over it anymore now don't get me wrong this is a great song I love this song don't get me wrong I love the song it's a classic 1950s song but I cannot and will not defend Frankie Lyman. I can't do it. Dude's been dead for what? Almost 60 years? Alright. Here we go. Morning, Eddie. Hey, Vito. I'd like to introduce you to somebody. Sorry if there's an echo. Vito, this is Carlo Falcone. Ooh! Pleasure to meet you, Mr. Falcone. Vito? So, Vito, how Hello, do you Falcone. feel about Alberto Clemente and Luco Gorino? Well, honestly, Mr. Falcone. The head of the Falcone The way family. I see it, those assholes tried to steal 5,000 bucks from me and then left me to rot in jail. That's good, because the two of them are planning to make a move on us. So it looks like we're going to have to do something before they do something. Eddie will tell you the rest. I'm sure you won't let me down. Goodbye, Mr. Falcone. Nice to meet you, Vito. So what the hell's going on? A car with three of our guys in it disappeared last night. And word around town is that Luca might have had something to do with it. Who's missing? Harvey Beans and the two guys who were supposed to be protecting him, Tony Balls Sorry and Frankie the account. Mick. Yeah. Beans is Carlo's accountant. If oh, he talks, we're all fucked. What do you need me to do? I need you to wait for him in front of Freddy's and follow him to find out if he's involved. And then, All right. if you find still. out that he had anything to do with this, you whack the bastard. Got and it. if any of our guys is still alive, 
Try and rescue him. Hopefully you can find him before they spill the beans about our operation. Where do you think he'll go? I got no idea. So go prepared. Make sure you've got a fast car and some firepower. I All got right, no some problem. Firepower. Okay, stop by here when you're done. And Vito, don't tell nobody about this. Got, got it. it, Eddie. Hi. I see you again soon, huh? I don't know every single 1950s song, so, you know, some of these, well, a majority of these songs I'm not really too familiar with, but the big ones, obviously the most well-known ones, yeah, I'm familiar with those, alright. I'm sorry, everybody, my ears itching for some reason. Brooklyn Bridge in front. I'm here. This is Luca's car. Freddy's bar. Now where are you, Luca? There you are. There he is. Okay, here we go. Shouldn't get too close. I gotta make sure Luca doesn't see me. Let him see you. Speed You got in my way, idiot. side. Junkyard, maybe. Nah, I might just give all this shit like this. And not the music on the radio, like the music in the game. That means something, something big is about to go down. I don't know what, but something big is about to happen. Mate and Co. Hmm. Meant the slaughterhouse, of course. Looks like Eddie was right. Okay, I gotta get in there without being seen. Into the slaughterhouse. Okay. Ah. Hmm. I hear dogs. Sorry, forgot my bathing suit. Uh, can't go swimming. Oh, no. 
I'm gonna have to go the into sewer. the sewer. Maybe that's the way in. Ew. Looks like I can pry this off. There we go. Or pry it open. Ew. Jesus Christ, that reeks. This is so gross. Ah, oh, that was a rat. Ew. Ah, oh, this is gross. Shit, that dog could be a problem. Like sewers. They give me the creeps. Oh, fuck. Ew. Ah. Oh, if Luke could just stop by to pick up some steaks, I'm gonna kill somebody. This way. No. Well, I just got covered in shit, basically. Somebody there? There's nobody there, see? So shut up before we turn you into meatloaf. Alright. Right. Shit, there they are. Now I got you, you skinny little prick. Walk under suspended load. Save your guys. Find out where they're being held. Fuck. All the, the way down there. there. Okay. Oh crap. Having one fucking smoke. Relax. Yeah, but... Are you around here? 
around here or what? Uh oh. And get back to work, or that ain't gonna be the only pig that's squealing. Okay, okay. I mean, shit. Freeze warning, take precaution. Oh, crap. So, uh, you still thinking about quitting? Yeah, probably next month. And what are you gonna do then? I was thinking of maybe, you know, becoming a voice actor. <sighs> are you kidding me? Who the hell would hire you? Good grief. Crap. Yeah, be right there. I'm gonna go down to the track today. Hey, who the fuck are you? Oh, crap. Oh, come on, let's kill these guys. <laughs> messed that up. Tell him, you idiots. I messed that up. Gave yourself away. No crap. No crap I did. And it puts me all the way back here. Lovely. Oh shit. All, right, yeah. all the way down there. What the fuck is going I don't on? Know. Don't look like hey, Tony came here. The little Just having one fucking smoke. Relax. Yeah, heard that one before, pal. <sighs> hey, what was that screaming? Same guy. What? Nah, that was no pig. That sounded like. What shit you mean? That was a pig. Just ignore it. You around here or what? Okay, okay. Shit.
So, uh, you still thinking about quitting? Yeah, probably next month. And what are you gonna do then? I was thinking of maybe, you know, becoming a voice actor. Shit. Are you kidding me? Who the hell would hire you? Pigs. And it's definitely in the slaughterhouse, all right. Sure thing. I thought I would have won a fortune. Alright. Think I don't know Made about it. the dope. I know where you got the money. Falcone thinks he's got a good racket going, but he ain't gonna get away with it. Come on. How'd you get it into the States? I don't know anything. I'm just an accountant. Don't fuck with me, you egghead bastard. You wanna end up just like your buddy here? Come on. Take a good look. You think you're tougher than him? After we're done with you, we're gonna grind you up in one of these machines here. <laughs> it's it's just a question of whether I'm gonna be nice enough to fucking kill you first. <laughs> hey, what's that fucking stench? Oh. Hey, uh, hey, somebody's over there. Hey, who the fuck are you supposed to be? Jesus Christ, what what is Captain Shipbag here to save the day? Shut the fuck up, Luca. Hey, I know you. You're the chump who was hanging around with that moron, Barbaro. I thought you were still rotting in the can. What the fuck you think you're doing here? Falcone sent me. He isn't too fond of skinny little cocksuckers trying to turn his guys into mincemeat. So, you joined up with Falcone, huh? Well, I'll tell you what. If you knew what was really going on, you'd realize that you was better off in jail. But oh, that don't matter you, now, dude. anyway. Whoa! Oh, crap. Come on, Mio. All right. I have to fight this guy. This going to be a mess. Come on. Come on, Vito. Sammy. <laughs> Gotta hit him. That's good. Ah, 
Ah, he got me. <sighs> Try that again. job veto all right here we go you don't know who you're fucking with kid come on fuck with the wrong guys asshole Reload. will you get me down please ah you lucky son of a bitch He took care of him. Eddie sent you? Yeah, he noticed he was a couple of guys shy at roll call. Shit. Ah. Poor Frankie. I'm gonna kill that son of a bitch. Beans, stay here and don't come out until we come get you. Okay, okay. Just don't forget about me. Okay, fellas? Alright. Fine, Luca. Alright. Where are you at, Luca, you son of a Bitch. Uh oh. oh Ow! Immediately dead. Holy crap. Get me down. Headshot. You fuck with the wrong guys. Hold well on. Loud. Will you get me down, please? Thanks, Vito. We owe you one. Eddie send you? Yeah, he noticed he was a couple of guys shy at rope. Shit. Oh, I could shoot him down. Poor oh, Frankie. Well. I'm gonna kill that son of a bitch. Beans, 
Stay here, and don't come out until we come get you. Uh, okay, okay. Just then. don't forget about me. Okay, fellas? Come on out, you little I friends. won't. Well, we won't. Fuck you! You missed me! Vito, show him what you got. <laughs> Not bad, kid. Oh, Not right. bad. Hey, douchebag, I'm over here. Good. Good shot, All right, Vito. Dude. Let's get that little fuck. Oh, little my. cocksucker's gonna piss his pants. Mm-hmm. I won't get out the Tommy gun. Reload? Yeah, they are. And guess who's next? A lot of guys with a lot of guns are already on their way over. Uh -oh. Shit, too late. Here they come. Oh dear. Holy shit. Uh-oh. They're making their way in. Bring it on, bastards. Come on. Gotcha. Four bullets left. Let's go, come on. Gotcha. Bring out the shotgun. I'm going in. Come on. Why you hiding, on. asshole? Got Nope. Damn, you survived a shotgun blast? Tough dude right there. He's still alive? Come on. Nice job. Now let's go get that little cocksucker. Knock, All knock. Right. Come on. Let me in. Fuck you. Come on. Just try it, get it. I can shoot the door down if you want me to. to be able to open it like this. Yeah, we need something heavy, like a, like a battery ram. Battery I know. Ram. We'll use that cart. Hmm. All right. Shoot the uh, planks out of the windows. There we go. Come here, you fuck. Gotcha. Like so you it feels like you know that. Son of a bitch. All right. I'm gonna have a little fun with Luca before I grind him up. Want to join me? Uh, Thanks for the invitation. I think I'll pass it. Uh, huh? No. 
Just hate the sight of Luca. I hear you, but you're missing out. I think I'm gonna try out that cattle pride he was yapping about. Uh, yeah. Have Eddie fun with that. Take care of him personally. Don't worry about that. It'll just take a little longer this way. This fuck don't deserve a quick death. I can't argue with that. Okay, I'm gonna go. I stink like an outhouse. I gotta get cleaned up. And tell Eddie he don't gotta worry about Luca. Yo, Beans, open the door. It's all over. You. You're still alive? Yeah. Mm -hmm. What'd you expect? Look, before we go home, you want to give me a hand with Sleeping Beauty here? You know, that's not such a bad idea. <laughs> Have fun, you two. Hi, I'm here. Actually, I'm way off, but hey, clothing store, I'll take it. What is that stench? I know, I'm sorry. All right, pal, let's make it quick. Give me a shirt. That'll do. Thank you, though. Come back, Amy. All right. it back. Hi. Mission successful. Hello. Hey, Vito, you made it. Hey, Eddie. Oh, nice threads. Thanks. Yep. How to so, get a new uh, change of clothes. What's the plan, fellas? What's with the suits? Vito, Mr. Falcone is going to bring us into the family tonight. You and me. All right. Gonna be made. No oh, shit. Tonight? Yeah. Really? Why didn't you tell me before? What do we gotta do? You'll find out. But first, there's somebody who'd like to have a little word with you. Leo. Good to see you. What are you doing here? Leo. <laughs> hey, kiddo. I wanna talk to you about what's gonna he got happen. Out. Today. Come here. Have a seat. All right. <sighs> sure. And hey, thanks again for doing whatever you did to get me out of the can early. Now I make good on my second promise to you. Second promise? Yeah. I told you the next time we opened the books, we'd recommend you, didn't I? And now it's done. You had something to do with this, but you work for Frank Vinci. Yeah. Hmm. I would have liked to have had you in our family, but I figured Joe there is your best friend. You guys grew up together, just like me and Frank. And since Joe was working for Carlo the whole time you were inside, I recommended they take you in, too, when he got made. Thanks, right. Leo. I, I don't know Thank what to you, say. Thank you, Leo. You don't gotta say nothing. Not to me or anybody else. That's kind of the way this whole thing works, Vito. <laughs> yeah. Now, come on. We don't want to keep him waiting. All right. All right. I'll see you fellas upstairs. 
What was that all about? Nah, nothing. Just, you know, talking about old times. Like that time when old Leo dropped the soap. Fuck <laughs> All right, all right, all right. That's enough. Let's go. These are like two school kids, I swear to God. All right. All right, wait here. Now listen to me, fellas. It's one at a time. Once you're inside, just do as you're told, okay? Got it. Joe, come on in. Hey. Good luck. All right, your turn, Vito. Gentlemen, this is Vito Scaletta. Vito, know that this family of ours is a secret. You are entering the Society of the Chosen, a society which does not exist to the rest of the world. Our family means more to you from now on than your own family, or God, or your country. If I ask you to kill your own brother, you must do it. Show me. Which finger would pull the trigger? Well then. Repeat after me, Vito. If I were to betray the secret of our way of life. If I were to betray the secret of our way of life. May my soul burn in hell. Just like this saint. May my soul burn in hell. Just like this saint. Amico Nostra. Gentlemen, I give you our new friend, Fido Scaletta. All right. I am very pleased to have these two talented and honest men join us. And I'm happy this has happened in the presence of our esteemed guests, especially Don Frank Vinci. And his You might wonder why I'd take this risk again after spending almost seven years in the can. You see, where I grew up, the only guys who mattered were the guys who had the balls to take what they wanted. You will receive payment for your services from Eddie. Would you like to add right. anything, Frank? Whatever you do, gentlemen, stay away from the dope. No Got dope. It. That's our policy. You can make plenty of money. And after years of doing everybody else's dirty work, too many risks. I was willing to risk anything to finally be somebody. Alright. Whoa! Trophy earned, man of honor. Hello. That was a nice car. <laughs> ah, good old Joe. Hey! I got me a house now! Alright! And a nice suit, too. And... Wow. Accepted into the Mafia family. Chapter... 10. Room service. Villa Scaletta, June 15th, 1951. Let the good times roll indeed. New artwork unlocked. Check the main menu. Answer the phone. I want to look around real quick. I got me a house. All right. Can access that. All right. But mafia business is serious business, though. It ain't always going to be fun in games. All right. Alright. Close that window. I got a swimming pool! 
Hell yeah! Oh man, this is a nice house. All right, this deserves a beer. I got my own home now. Good job, Vito. You made a mess though with the potato chips. <laughs> That's outside. Alright. Let's we'll see if I unlocked anything special. Casual suit. Alright. Renegade pack. High school outfit. Okay. Red jacket with shirt. Alright. Greaser pack. Bike clothes. Racer pack, racing suit, nice. Shirt with trousers, tailored suit, expensive suit and hat. Gotta have an expensive suit and hat if you're a part of the mafia. Casual suit and ring coat. And that's it. Oh, I could change the colors of this. All right. Well, I just went over 60 minutes, so I'm going to have to do a little bit of editing. But anyways, where have I seen this suit before? It looks awfully familiar to me, but I, I can't I can't pinpoint it off the top of my head where I've seen this suit before. Hmm. You know what? Let's put it on. Alright, I, I'm just kidding. Obviously, it's the it's the same type of suit that uh, Kiru Kazama wears in Yakuza. I got an ironing board. Do I have any magazines? No. This song has been playing repeatedly over and over again. Alright, there we go. Hopefully that'll fix it. Yep, it did. Nothing for me to collect here? I can't turn the TV on? Come on. Oh well. Alright, well. I'm going to have to do a tiny little bit of editing, but that's going to do it here for this Mafia 2 Let's Play video. Vito Scaletta is a part of the family. He's got a nice suit, a nice house. Life is going good. That's going to do it here for this Mafia 2 Let's Play video. Thanks everybody for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Peace out everyone.